Oh, Mama, we are just so glad you and Daddy actually did have a plan. We were so afraid we were going to have to put you in a nursing home. And no, we aren't going to do that. Summer, hon, why don't you already head home already? Uh, it sounds like your boss is, is really giving you a hard time. Head home. And we will be there by the end of the week. The rest of us will help mom get everything set up and be here when um, Aunt Michelle shows up. Does that sound good to you? Oh, thank you, guys. Thank you so much. He has been riding me big time. He's been texting every 10 minutes, I swear. Oh, thank you so much, Mama. We love you so much. And we want you to know that we will be here for you anytime you need us, okay? I cannot wait until your Aunt Michelle gets here. I miss her. I really, really do. And Mama, we promise not to tell Aunt Michelle about the words that you use. Hello everyone. I finally made it. Oh, Lynette, I'm so sorry about John. But how are you doing, my dear? How are you? Oh, Michelle, I'm so glad you're here. Thank you. I'm doing all right, darling. I'm doing all right. I'm still learning this silly old contraption, but I'm doing well. We're getting along well. No, oh, I'm so glad to hear that. And girls, how are you? I have missed you so much. I'm so sorry about your daddy. But I promise I'll take real good care of your mama. Oh, Auntie Michelle, we're doing really well. Um... Summer couldn't be here, I'm sorry to say. She had to go home because of her job, but she wanted us to tell you she loves you and she misses you and she can't see, wait until next time when she can see you. Oh, well, you give that little girl a kiss for me when you see her next and tell her I miss her too. Well, now, Michelle, of uh how was your trip up here, and, and how are little Michelle and um, Axel doing these days? How are they going to get along without you? Oh, well, the trip up here was uneventful, Annette. It, it's beautiful country, and I'm so glad to be coming home. Little Michelle and Axel are doing fine, but, oh, girl, do I have a story for you. You are not going to believe what happened when we went home the last time we come to visit. Little Michelle caught that hussy of a girlfriend of hers cheating on her in her own home. Can you believe it? Oh, my goodness. Poor Michelle. Oh, my. Oh, man. Poor Michelle. That had to be horrible. Oh, let me tell you. I've never seen Michelle so upset in my life. I got so angry, Lynette, that I put the smack down on that little... Achoo!
my goodness, that little fellow is, is Snowball. Some heartless soul dropped him off in the road a few weeks ago, and, well, I've been beating him ever since. Oh, goodness, Aunt Michelle, I'm so sorry. Someone must have left the door open. I I'll take him outside right away. Achoo! Oh, oh, thank you, Adam, thank you. Oh, Lynette, honey, I'm sorry to say, but if I'm going to live here, that cat's going to have to go. I am seriously allergic to those little critters. Oh, but I can't bear the thought of taking him to the pound. You know what will happen if I do. Now, Mama, don't you worry about Snowball. Me and the girls will take him home with us when we leave. Yeah, that's right, Mama. Uh, my little kittens could use a playmate. Ice would just love him. Oh, boy. Summer's not gonna like that. Oh, well. Let's not think about that right now. I want to hear more about Auntie Michelle's Smackdown. Oh, yeah. Me, too. I want to hear all about it. Oh, yeah, that's right. Me three. Me three. Do tell, Auntie Michelle. That's right. My little sister, the Smackdown Diva. I want details, woman. Details. Oh, my God, Lynette, you are such a hoot. But... Let me tell you right now, I put that little girl in, oh, you, I cannot tell you how, oh, my God, my 